Hi everyone, sorry for being absent so long, but uh, we had quite a stressful time after the make affair. After working for about uh, two months, 20 hours a day, we were quite, we went like in coma <laughs> Sunday night. So um, when we woke up three days later, um, we said, well, since uh, there will be uh, Christmas holidays soon, uh, let's talk about uh, going back to work after those holidays. And after that we sat down and said, well, since the new office, because we will be leaving this one for a better one uh, uh, soon, uh, is almost ready. So uh, it, it has almost no importance uh, unboxing everything we took away from uh, the fair and uh, back in the office and then pack it up again in boxes and move it to the new office. We said, uh, well, let's just leave everything there for th three weeks, four weeks, should not take much longer than that, and move to the new office. Uh, well, so it, everything is idle for now and as you can see, it's a mess. It's a mess because we had to finish the marine in a real hurry and if you remember last video, uh, almost everything was already lying around the shop and uh, uh, you see there are pieces of uh, blue tape around, um, masking tape around, there are still the boxes of prints we took at the fair with us. Uh, Lots of debris, lots of cutted parts. Uh, it's a total mess. And the armor is lying around here and there. We have some pieces here, we have some pieces there in the chem lab. Um, well, it has been quite a ride, let me tell you that. Mega Fair was very, very good this year, also because we had a double stand and uh, it was uh, really nice to see everyone cheering at us at uh, the armor and uh, really it was wonderful unfortunately everyone has seen the armor and not the printer but <laughs> anyway some people told us oh, oh nice armor how did you print that and we said that with the dead printer it was lying Besides that, and everyone didn't notice that, I mean, it's not that small, I know that it's naked, so it could be anything, I mean, because it, it's like an empty box, uh, more than a printer, but it's a printer, anyway. After the fair, we decided to focus more on, the, on finishing those printers, making them complete by this year. Uh, so, what we will do, it will be um, working together with IGUS, uh, which uh, kindly uh, offered uh, their help to us uh, uh, to make better printers, we hope so, because uh, we feel we are getting close to a very cheap but uh, very precise and uh, usable printer. With usable I mean that you don't have to have any kind of uh, experience prior to using that. and. Uh, which is also user, easy to assemble and uh, maintain. And so uh, those printers, these and her bigger sister there, uh, the ones with the belts on the Z axis, the vertical axis, they could be the ones that uh, really will be our first sellable product. Uh, so. I hope so. So on, on the near future, after we will move to the new office, we will continue uh, finishing, I hope so, finishing the, all the, the prototypes and move on to new stuff. And uh, well, we're almost there. We've seen that with the belt driven vertical axis uh, with the Trinamic, uh, TMC2130, like these ones that we uh, have actually, uh, we are using them in, um, w without programming them because we were 
still trying to understand how to program them uh, before Thomas Sanladerer on his video uh, and uh, Alberto Cotronei on his uh, uh, Marlin Kimbra page told us how to use them on a common ramps uh, without uh, soldering anything, just um, wiring them, for example, to uh, free jump. Uh, mm, nice. Uh, something fell off. Um, I mean, uh, using, for example, uh, unused uh, uh, end stop uh, inputs uh, to program them with common SPI interface. Well, anyway, uh, just keep in mind that those, I think, will be the standard for any high quality printer for quite a time. I mean, they are really powerful. Uh, we told about them on uh, earlier videos, but uh, I've seen them working again and again by using, for example, their smaller brothers, the 2208, which are even more silent than those, uh, on that printer over there, and they work like a charm, really. Now, uh, everything is still, uh, we are still waiting for uh i mean for the new office to be ready for the work crew to finish it and uh, give us the keys so we can move on uh, so <clears throat> beside that well the printer will be better the printers will be better and you'll see some cool stuff but for now you'll just have to keep waiting but but uh there is a video that we are about to upload, which is the one we assembled from all the GoPro cameras, uh, the Nikons around, and all the cameras. Well, we had we bring there to register us with the Marine Armor, and uh, the, you will see me walking inside the armor, and um, uh, well. Uh, it is quite a view. I think we mm, literally took all the audience of the Pavilion 8. It was quite a, quite a time, let me say. Uh, unfortunately, while moving uh, the armor to the fair, uh, this printer struck the armor while going to the fair and slightly damaged it. So we could not uh, wear it up until Sunday the last day but on that last day it was quite a view let me tell you that also because we had uh, uh, working uh, fans smoke speakers on the front beside the two fission battery ports because we didn't have time to make the all the fission batteries and we used them like caps for speakers and uh, it worked quite well you'll see on the video. Also we had the luck to meet uh, Joseph Prusa which uh, if you are in the 3D business is like a divinity so it was really quite a sense I don't know I am really if like you shake your hand to God uh, it was like that the the feeling yeah and um, well you'll see on the video. Joseph, if you're watching this, remember that we would like to 3D print a bus of yourself. Besides that, uh, well, just a little bit fandom. So, we'll, I will leave you with the video that we will uh, think, um, no, I think we'll uh, upload later. It won't be made by us if it would be not completed. So, the video you will see about the fair is not the final version and I sincerely do not know if there will be a, ever a final version of that because well you know it's us in like all, all our videos and so well for now i think it's everything we had to say so see you next time hopefully soon bye bye